Okay, so this is the Donna Fisher Master Bathroom Project that we just finished. Isn't that a beautiful view looking right out of the bathroom? I didn't have much to do with that. It was already here before I got here, but it is very nice. So before there was just an opening here, there was not a door. We put a pocket door in here. And as you can see, it is rain glass, which is really nice. And this is a towel warmer. The toilet is actually in the same spot. We didn't have to move the toilet. We have a little toilet space there. And then in this corner, we put the walk-in shower. It's a pretty big walk-in shower with the uh, tile block. It is five foot one way and six foot the other. And then we use the Japanese pebbles for the floor. And a wand on one wall with its own separate valve and then a shower head on the other wall. And then a shower niche. And the vanity used to be against the wall behind me, so we moved it to the other side of the room and we did this backsplash that we decided to put all the way around the mirror to kind of have a border all the way to the ceiling. We are missing a globe for one light fixture. It was supposed to be in, but it is not in yet granite countertop with rectangle sinks, undermount sinks, new faucets of course. Tile floor in a 45 degree angle to the walls. So that is about it. You know I just remember that I did not get a video of this bathroom before we started and I was kind of upset at myself for not doing it but we got in here started doing the demo and uh, forgot to do a video so what was here before was an old old 1970s uh, vintage bathroom this toilet had its own room right there at the corner of the glass block, there was a wall going across over to this wall, and then a pocket door that let you into the toilet space. And then there was another wall coming across, and in this corner there was a bathtub. So the bathroom was quite small because it had these walls in here that kind of uh, sectioned things off so that it was very small. So by taking those walls out, we really increase the size and the feel to this master bathroom. So I'm extremely pleased at how this turned out. It was a very challenging but a very fun job to try to get the, all the glass block to work out, especially this corner here, to be able to have it at exactly the right height and also the exact length that it needed to come out from the wall to have it all fit in. This is my Bermuda Triangle corner right there. That's what I'm calling it because that was, it is a, it, it is a very difficult thing. Anyways, I would like to have more jobs like this, even challenging jobs, especially with a view.